Kevin Spacey as Francis J. Frank Underwood Kevin Spacey Fowler, KBE, was born on July 26, 1959. He is an American actor, producer, and singer. Spacey began his career as a stage actor during the 1980s, obtaining supporting roles in film and television. He gained critical acclaim in the 1990s, culminating in an Academy Award for Best Supporting Actor for the neo-noir crime thriller The Usual Suspects 1995 and an Academy Award for Best Actor for the midlife crisis-themed drama American Beauty 1999. Spacey's first roles in film were in Mike Nichols' Heartburn 1986 and Working Girl 1988. Spacey's other starring roles have included Glenn Gary Glenn Ross 1992, the comedy drama film Swimming with Sharks 1994, the psychological thriller Seven 1995, the neo-noir crime film LA Confidential 1997, the drama Pay It Forward 2000, the science fiction mystery film K-Pax 2001, the musical biopic Beyond the Sea 2004, the superhero film Superman Returns 2006, and the action film Baby Driver 2017. In October 2017, actor Anthony Rapp accused Spacey of making a sexual advance toward him in 1986, when Rapp was 14. Numerous other men subsequently came forward alleging that Spacey had made unwanted advances and sexually harassed them as well. As a result of the allegations, Netflix cut ties with Spacey, shelving his film Gore and removing him from the last season of House of Cards. Spacey's role as J. Paul Jetty in Ridley Scott's film All the Money in the World 2017 was reshot with actor Christopher Plummer in his place. In 2018, Billionaire Boys Club, which had been completed before the allegations surfaced, was released with Spacey's role unchanged. Kevin Spacey Fowler was born in South Orange, New Jersey to Kathleen Ann Nee Knutson, a secretary, and Thomas Joffrey Fowler, a technical writer and data consultant. Spacey has an older brother, Randy Fowler, who is a limousine driver and Rod Stewart impersonator in Boise, Idaho, and a sister, Julie Ann Fowler, here an office worker. His family relocated to Southern California when he was four years old. Spacey attended Northridge Military Academy, Canoga Park High School in the 10th and 11th grades. He graduated co-valedictorian along with Mayor Winningham of the class of 1977 of Chatsworth High School in Chatsworth, California. At Chatsworth, Spacey starred in the school's senior production of The Sound of Music, playing the part of Captain Georg Von Trapp with Winningham as Maria Von Trapp. He started using his middle name Spacey, which is also his paternal grandmother's maiden name. Spacey had tried to succeed as a comedian for several years before attending the Juilliard School in New York City as a member of Group 12, where he studied drama with teacher Marianne Seldes between 1979 and 1981. During this time period, he performed stand-up comedy in bowling alley talent contests. Spacey's first professional stage appearance was as a spear carrier in a New York Shakespeare Festival performance of Henry VI, Part 1 in 1981. The following year, he made his first Broadway appearance as Oswald in a production of Henrik Ibsen's Ghost, starring Liv Ullman. Then he portrayed Philante in Moliere's The Misanthrope. In 1984, Spacey appeared in a production of David Rave's Hurley Burley, in which he rotated through each of the male parts. He would later play Mickey in the film version. Next came Anton Chekhov's The Seagull alongside David Strathairn and Colleen Dewhurst. In 1986, Spacey appeared in a production of Sleuth in a New Jersey dinner theater. Spacey's prominence as a stage actor began in 1986, when he was cast opposite Jack Lemmon, Peter Gallagher, and Bethel Leslie as Jamie, the eldest Tyrone's son, in Jonathan Miller's lauded production of Eugene O'Neill's Long Day's Journey into Night. Lemon in particular would become a mentor to Spacey and was invited along with Spacey's high school drama teacher to be present when Spacey received his star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame in 1999. Spacey made his first major television appearance in the second season premiere of Crime Story playing a Kennedy-esque American senator. Although his interest soon turned to film, Spacey remained actively involved in the live theater community. In 1991, he won a Tony Award for his portrayal of Uncle Louie in Neil Simon's Broadway hit Lost in Yonkers. Spacey's father was unconvinced that Spacey could make a career for himself as an actor and did not change his mind until Spacey became well-known. 
Spacey quickly developed a reputation as a character actor and was cast in bigger roles, including the malevolent office manager in the ensemble film Glen Gary Glen Ross 1992, one half of a bickering Connecticut couple in the dark comedy film The Ref 1994, and a malicious Hollywood studio boss in the satire Swimming with Sharks 1995, gaining him positive notices by critics. Spacey's performance as the enigmatic criminal Verbal Kind in Brian Singer's 1995 neo-noir film The Usual Suspects won him the Academy Award for Best Supporting Actor. In 1995, Spacey also appeared in the David Fincher's detective thriller Seven, making a sudden entrance late in the film as a serial killer John Doe, after going uncredited and unmentioned in the film's advertisements and opening credits. His work in Seven, The Usual Suspects, and Outbreak earned him Best Supporting Actor honors at the 1995 Society of Texas Film Critics Awards. Spacey played an egomaniacal district attorney in A Time to Kill 1996 and founded Trigger Street Productions in 1997 with the purpose of producing and developing entertainment across various media. Spacey made his editorial debut with the film Albino Alligator 1996. The film was a box office bomb grossing $339,379 with a budget of $6 million, but critics praised Spacey's direction. He also voiced Hopper in the animated film A Bug's Life 1998. Throughout his career, Spacey has been well known for playing villains. Spacey hosted Saturday Night Live twice, first in 1997 with musical guest Beck and special guests Michael Palin and John Cleese from Monty Python's Flying Circus, and again in May 2006 with musical guest Nelly Furtado. In 2006, Spacey played Lex Luthor in the Brian Singer superhero film Superman Returns. He was to return for its 2009 sequel, but the series was instead rebooted with the 2013 film Man of Steel. Spacey also appeared in Edison, which received a direct-to-video release in 2006. Spacey is well known in Hollywood for his impressions. When he appeared on Inside the Actor's Studio, he imitated, at host James Lipton's request, Jack Lemmon, James Stewart, Johnny Carson, Katherine Hepburn, Clint Eastwood, John Gilgood, Marlon Brando, Christopher Walken, and Al Pacino. As a young actor in New York City, he used his skill to pretend to be Carson's son to obtain free theater tickets and enter Studio 54. Capital EMI's album Forever Cool 2007 features two duets with Spacey and an earlier recording of Dean Martin, Ain't That a Kick in the Head and King of the Road. In December 2007, Spacey co-hosted the Nobel Peace Prize concert along with Uma Thurman. Spacey is a patron of the Shakespeare Schools Festival, a charity that enables school children across the UK to perform Shakespeare in professional theatres. He also sits on the board of directors of the Motion Picture and Television Fund. On March 18, 2011, it was announced that Spacey was cast as Frank Underwood in the Netflix series House of Cards, adapted from a 1990 BBC political drama of the same name. He was nominated for the Primetime Emmy Award for Outstanding Lead Actor in a Drama Series at the 65th Primetime Emmy Awards in 2013, becoming the first lead actor to be Primetime Emmy nominated from a web television series. Spacey went on to win the Golden Globe Award for Best Actor in a Television Series Drama at the 72nd Golden Globe Awards and Screen Actors Guild nomination for Outstanding Performance by a Male Actor in a Drama Series at the 21st Screen Actors Guild Awards for a Season 2 performance. In July 2011, Spacey co-starred in the black comedy film Horrible Bosses, which grossed over $209.6 million at the box office. He executive produced the biographical survivor thriller film Captain Phillips in 2013, which was nominated for the Academy Award for Best Picture. Spacey portrayed the antagonist Jonathan Irons in the 2014 video game Call of Duty Advanced Warfare Through Motion Capture. He starred as President Richard Nixon in the comedy drama Elvis and Nixon 2016 which is based on the meeting that took place between Nixon and singer Elvis Presley Michael Shannon in December 1970, wherein Presley requested Nixon swear him in as an undercover agent in the Bureau of Narcotics and Dangerous Drugs. He next starred in the comedy film Nine Lives as a man trapped in the body of a cat. The film was released on August 5, 2016. In March 2017, it was announced that Spacey would portray J. Paul Jetty in Ridley Scott's All the Money in the World. He shot his role in the film in 10 days over the summer of 2017, 
However, due to the sexual assault allegations against Spacey, it was announced on November 8, 2017 that all of his footage would be excised and that Christopher Plummer would replace Spacey as Getty in reshoots. In spite of the very tight schedule, TriStar Pictures completed the new version of the film in time for a December 25 release. Spacey appeared in the film Billionaire Boys Club, which had a limited release on August 17, 2018. Vertical Entertainment stated that they would be taking no action to remove Spacey from the film, as it had been completed in late 2016, prior to the allegations made in October 2017. Over his decade-spanning career, Spacey has won two Academy Awards, a Tony Award, a Golden Globe Award, four Screen Actors Guild Awards, and a British Academy Film Award. He was nominated for a Grammy Award as well as 12 Primetime Emmy Awards. Spacey received a star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame in 1999 and was named an Honorary Commander and Knight Commander of the Order of the British Empire in 2010 and 2015 respectively. In 1999, the report suggested Spacey was dating a script supervisor named Diane Dreher, with their relationship possibly dating back as far as 1992. In 2000, Spacey brought Dreher to the Academy Awards. In October 2017, Spacey came out as gay.